Hey y'all, since everything is blooming these days, I thought maybe we would do um, something floral today. So we don't necessarily have these here, but I have seen them every once in a while, but we're gonna do a lilac, um, some beautiful purple blooms. So here we go. First thing we're gonna do is put some water, just plain clear water, and kind of do it in a cone shape that kind of just bends over at the top a little bit and it gets fatter at the bottom okay so now i don't know if you can really see this but we've got the water on there and i'm just going to pick up some purple paint very lightly do this and you can see it's going to just move around in that water that we've already gotten on the paper, which is the reason it's called watercolor. And it's just gonna move around. And you can see I'm just kind of tapping my brush. And just not, not getting it really straight on the sides. We want it to be kind of uneven, kind of frilly because they are, and we're doing just a light color to begin with. Okay, so now I'm gonna pick up some more purple and I'm just gonna kinda deepen the color some, and probably more so around, a little around the bottom, and then where it kinda bends over, which is where you would see most of the shadow. Now I'm gonna pick up another color. This is blue. And we're just going to touch some of that kind of in there just to give it some more depth. And it's going to kind of mix with the water too that's already there. And then I'm going to pick up a little more purple and just kind of deepen the color some, especially keeping it more toward that edge and bottom. Fun, fun. Love how the watercolor mingles all the colors together. All right, so I think we're going to add a little more blue again just to give it some depth. All right, guys, we're almost done. Okay, a little more purple maybe right in here. Again, this adds some depth and gives it kind of a round cone shape, which is the way the lavender looks. And there you have it. Now, if you want to add a stem, it's kind of a woody stem, so it would be more, probably more brown. So we're just gonna pick up a little brown and pull us a little stem. Let's see if I can get a little more brown here. Didn't quite get enough color. And just pull us a little stem there. And then once it dries, it will be a little lighter. But there you have your lavender.